Yeah, there's a lot of misconceptions about lactate and what it means in skeletal muscle. Uh, many, many people believe that you only produce lactate when you're in a so-called anaerobic or lacking oxygen situation, but that isn't the case. Uh, because there is a lot of flux or movement down the glycolytic pathway, and not all of the pyruvate that's produced goes into the mitochondria to be oxidized, we do produce some lactate. And uh, when we're working very hard, uh, we cannot get all of the energy we need from the aerobic system. So in that situation, we need the glycolytic activity to be working very fast to produce energy anaerobically. And of course, the byproducts of pyruvate cannot be handled in the mitochondria. It has to be shuttled to lactate so that we can regenerate what we need to keep the glycolytic system going. So the lactate is a necessary byproduct of that particular situation. And of course, when we stop exercising, a lot of the lactate can be retaken up by the muscle or simply reconverted to pyruvate and used as a fuel.